The campus of William Carey was calm as the clock struck midnight and the date turned to January 21st, 2017. Freshman soccer player Taylor Gatro turned in at about 1 a.m. She would be awoken two hours later to the sounds of a violent tornado just outside her dorm room wall. It just sounded like whistling. It sounded dangerous. So I knew that I needed to get out of the room because I looked through the window and I saw that the rain was going sideways, and I'm like, that, that's not good. As Gatro rushed to shut her bedroom door, a gush of wind slammed it shut onto her right hand, severing her last three fingers. I was closing it, and then as soon as I was closing it, the wind and the pressure from the tornado blew out the window, and the wind came in and slammed the door shut. Gatro would eventually be okay. Several nursing students helped stop the bleeding, and she would be taken to Jackson to undergo successful surgery, although doctors would not be able to save her fingers. But Gatro recovered, and just a few weeks later was back playing soccer with the Lady Crusaders. She really never missed a beat when she got back into being released. Um, she never missed a beat, and she never used her uh, injury to, as an excuse. Now I'm just right back where I was. And because it is soccer, I don't have to use my hands that much. Rising above adversity, Gatro and the Lady Crusaders would go on to an historical run to the semifinals of the Soccer National Championships, a first in school history. Anything that came in their way throughout the year, they just got on with it and there was no complaints. And I really think going through what they went in the spring, you know, being, you know, we were training off campus, everything we did was off campus and they never complained. I think that had a lot to do with just their mentality going into the season. Carey still rebuilds a year later, but that recovery is made easier by the school's strong foundation and unshakable resolve. If I go, if I go walk around night, right now somewhere on this campus, I bet you I can still find glass somewhere on the ground from all the windows being shattered. Yeah, there's recovery going on every day, but uh, again, you know, I haven't heard one complaint or one negative thing. It's all about how great Carey's going to be moving forward and we'll be better and stronger with it and I, and I truly think we will. Reporting for WDAM, I'm Taylor Curette.